Hey everyone, what's up? Yo, Chicksy Austin here, and today I'm back with another battle versus um, Logan TT7, and he is Master of Pokemon 100's brother. So he asked me for a battle, and I accepted it because I love to battle people. Remember, if you want to battle me, just send me a message. And that Gliscor, I'm still looking for it, but don't worry about it because I just put the picture up there to see it, or because I didn't have anything to put behind it. I gotta get the time to do my Pokemon Emerald walkthrough, and that'll be up soon. So let's get into the battle. I start out with my Cacturn and Vaporeon. He starts out with Rhydon and Dialga. I didn't really care about Dialga, but one thing I had to point out, we did have another single battle before this one, and he did beat me. But unfortunately, I forgot to save it because I was watching Family Guy at the time, and I just forgot to press the A button. So he beat me before. I give him props for that. Good job. And I wouldn't really say Dialga is really uber, because and Uxie. They're not really that much of an uber Pokemon because you can take them out kind of easily if you have fire types or dark types. So luckily I had my ca cac turn out at the time when his Uxie was there. But I used Ice Beam on Dialga and then he gets the Freeze Hacks which this happens to him this happened to him last battle too. So kind of sucks for him. So I use a Sucker Punch on Uxie to deal a great amount of damage. but th And then he used Extra Sensory on uh, Bronzong. So yeah. He uses a Dragon Pulse on Cacturn and almost takes it out. So I use a second Sucker Punch to take out his Uxie. So now that leaves two Pokemon down. And I think one down. Wait. No, I don't have any down for me. So, after he gets unfrozen, I hit him with a Hypnosis. Then he sends out his Blade, which is Weavile, and he switches to his Boom Boom. So then his Weavile uses Dark Pulse. And personally, if you have a Weavile and a Dark Move, I don't know why they set it to this, but its attack is stronger than its special attack, so I don't know why they let it learn Dark Pulse on level instead of, like, uh, Shadow Claw or something, something like that, or, like... I think it learns Night Slash before that. Like, uh, yeah, for like heart scales or whatever. So, yeah. So, my Cacturn dies from the eruption and my Bronzong survives. So, then I send out uh, Waffle again. And I use a Strength. I still haven't removed that from Bronzong, but it's kind of helpful. It does a nice amount of damage. So, then he uses a second eruption to take out uh, Bronzong with a critical hit. So, yeah. And, of course, Waffle doesn't take that much damage. So I use a Hydro Pump to take out a uh, camera. It's boom, boom. Boom, boom. So he uses a Dark Pulse on a Vaporeon. Doesn't take it out, though. I knew it wouldn't because my va Vaporeon's pretty powerful. I actually got it from my Diamond. So, lucky for me, he sends out Diaga when I send out uh, my Infernape. So I use a Hydro Pump to take out Weavile and then his... Uh, Dialga is asleep, so then I use a Blast Burn to take out Dialga. So, yeah. And this is, a, it actually gets exciting at the end here. Yeah, so he starts out Star After. This is what I cleared like three or four of my Pokemon on our single battle. It's like really power, it's like really fast. So I use an Ice Beam, and then guess what happens? He gets the Freeze Hacks again right there so I have to recharge from the hit and this is nearing the end of the battle so yeah alright you guys if you like the battle comment rate subscribe PM me if you want a battle and thanks for watching